Okay, well, the idea started um, about seven years ago. Uh, a friend of mine, Joshua Davidson, wrote a story called The Nighttime Zookeeper whilst he was studying his art undergrad at Newcastle University. Um, and then from there, the ideas kind of... Uh, it, was, it was trial in a few schools. We did it as a school project um, a couple of years after that. And then, yeah, we just, it's just kind of been on a slow burner ever since. Um, and yeah, this weekend's been great for it. Would you like to introduce me and everyone else who's viewing to your team over the 54 hours? And if everyone would like to say who they are and uh, say how they felt and what their expertise is. And, and I know you're all a bit emotional and you're going to go on the but if you just like quickly just introduce everyone and they can have a quick, a quick say so. Yeah, sure. Right, well, this time I think I'll, uh, I'll let them do the talking. So uh, this is Charmaine. Um, hi, I'm Charmaine. Um, so we all met on Friday and um, for me it was like very meaningful to see that, you know, being able to have the creativity to make new animals, that's something even before, you know, beyond God's evolution. <laughs> and it has all that creativity into it. And what was very nice is, was also to see both technical, um, educational and also business aspects all put together and I felt it was a completely awesome experience. Yeah, and what did you, you learn to it, Sean? What was your skill set? Okay, um, actually my background was um, a mixed bag. Um, I was, um, like for the last year, I've been spending a lot of time doing startups. Um, I, yeah, I'm a founder of my own little startup which is animal related because I designed a jewellery line. So this is completely, that means a lot and brings a lot of you know, meaning to me at heart. Uh, hi, I'm Ed. Um, I've had a good look around the e-learning market around Europe over the last six months, and there's a real lack of creative, particularly uh, creative writing content uh, for students of this age group. I was really excited to hook up with Paul, learn about his idea, and I've just learned such an incredible amount about how to adapt ideas, how to spark off everyone else and create something just as magical and wonderful as uh, Zookeeper is. And what's your expertise then? Um, so I've done a lot of market analysis within this, partly as a non-evil investment banker uh, and partly as a, an internet entrepreneur. So we're really hoping to see this one fly. Simon, I've been working on the project for about the last six to eight months. I live with Paul and uh, seen this idea grow from, from Josh and Paul together. And um, yeah, it's just something you know, I've helped out with and I've got more and more involved in and grown to love the project and more of it and uh, feel very passionate about, about it. So um, this weekend has been fantastic. It's been so rejuvenating uh, the, the project and I think me and Paul could both vouch for that and yeah, so excited about what could possibly happen and yeah, thanks everyone. Hi, I'm Simon. Uh, I come into this team with a background in education and business over the last 20 odd years. Um, but for me, this this weekend has been all about learning. Um, we've all been on a journey and as a team, it's been remarkable what different skills we've brought to the development of, of the product and the business that we've put together. Um, and you know, we've been very successful. I think part of the reason for that success is the real mix of skills that we've got across the team and how we've contributed and, and, and put those all together. It's been a great, great weekend. Um, I'm Oliver, I'm a lecturer in education at Plymouth University and a former primary school teacher. And I came here really to, to learn from the process and I was even going to sit outside of the process and just blog about it. But the idea really spoke to me because it was child-centred and it was children's creativity with the user-generated content. I just thought it was great and there's nothing out there and that is a real passion of mine. So I was sucked into the team and I've, just, I've learned so much from working with other people and we've built something that hopefully a business of learning, but also we've just learned so much and I've learned so much about business from all of these guys and from bouncing ideas off and forcing creativity to happen for two to four hours. So it's a really interesting model for me to learn.
bring back into education. I'll just say thank you to all of you and I hope you have a great night and success and congratulations. Well done. Thanks, Leo. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.